Hey everyone, it is Anthony and Joe from Dave and Adams. We're coming at you with another break. We have Paldean Fates Elite Trainer Boxes. We're going to be cracking open. Uh, Paldean Fates is a uh, new half set, all reprints. Yep. Um, with We're just looking for styles. some shiny vaults, some yep. illustrator rares, and some special illustrator rares, yes. and some gold cards. Yep, so we got uh, big hits out of this. Uh, there's a nice new uh, Shining Charizard EX. Well, it's regular Charizard EX, but it's the shiny version. Yep. Uh, which it's is, also dark type. Yes, it's a yeah. reprint of the Obsidian Flames Charizard. Uh, there's a reprint of Iono with the new art, so that's going to be one of the popular cards for sure. Iono is, I think, the most played card in Pokemon right now. Um, there's also an alternate Gardevoir EX, another very, very popular card as well. Um, and the Mew. And the Mew. The yeah. Mew EX is played in pretty much every deck, pretty free include. Uh, there's also a Corridon gold card. Um, so lots of very, very cool stuff in here. We're um, going to open yeah. two of these and give away the third. If you want to win that one, there's going to be an instruction on what to comment on this video to try and win it. Absolutely. All right, should we just smash cut and star wipe to these boxes being opened? Absolutely. We'll be right back with the hits. So we've opened our 18 packs and two ETBs of Paldean Fates. Uh, we got some pretty cool stuff to uh, to show off here. So I'm going to start just with these, you know, the things that come in every ETB. These are what the dice look like. Uh, standard uh, poison and burn counters. I think those look the same with every ETB. Very cool. Uh, Mimic use sleeves. I actually like these a lot. Sleeves and are foil. And a very cool Mimikyu promo uh, to go with it. Uh, this card's actually not bad competitively either, yeah. um, but just a cool art. Mimikyu is very cool. Um, next, like I said, all reprints, so there's no worried, like no wondering what's uh, like going to be playable in, in standard or whatever. Uh, just a lot of like very core cards. All of these are, you know, Nest Ball, Ultra Ball, Rare Candy, and Artisan. Uh, very like competitively viable staples right now that you can just get in these packs, as well as regular Iono, which we got four of out of our two ETBs, which is a lot. That's a playset, even. Well, yeah, I mean, this one's reverse foil, one but... It's reverse yeah. foil, um, yeah. so... But still very cool. Um, yeah. This was, like, a $3 card from Valley Evolve, so cool to see that get reprinted as well. Um, kind of it for the uh, boring stuff, I should say. Yeah. Um, so we got a few shinies to show off here from the... Uh, not called the shiny vault in this set, but it's one of the, uh, the, the hallmarks of this set. Uh, shiny Sneasel, Shiny Varum, Shiny Primeape, and Annihilate, which is kind of cool. And a Shiny Green Bird. I like the Green Bird. Yeah, Bird Law applies. This is, I think, the coolest looking of the, of the cards on the table. Uh, but I, pink Sneasel is also I like good. Lemonade Sneasel. Yeah. That, uh, strawberry Lemonade, yeah. Yeah, pink and yellow. Yeah, yeah, yeah both Lemonade. And the, the Annihilate colors fit, but uh, yeah. Green Bird's very, very charming. Also, all of them has stars, which go with the star wipes that I hope have been happening yes. periodically throughout this video well, every time we cut. They have to now. Yeah. They don't have a choice. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. We editing. won't. Know, I won't know until this gets edited. I can't see the star wipes in real time. <laughs> the while editing I say them. team hates this one simple trick. Uh, we got a couple uh, regular EXs and a, uh, a full art EX as well. Uh, Fortress and Noivern and Wigglytuff, all reprints. Um, Wigglytuff was from 151. I want to say Noivern and Fortress were both from base card. That might be wrong yeah. about that. We also got the the two different kinds of base EXs because the Fortress is textured, and the Noivern just the galaxy. Yeah. Is the galaxy foil. Star foil. So, pretty cool. Uh, the Wigglytuff is extra yeah. as well. So. Um, yeah, pretty good card, this Wigglytuff. Uh, the the illustration from uh, 151 was like an $8 card, so uh, nice reprint. Uh, we got one very cool gallery uh, illustration rare card, uh, the Palafin, uh, the Batman Palafin. A lot of people were very excited for this one. It does look very cool. Yeah. Uh, shiny as well. Um, very, very ominous, going to beat up a bunch of criminally insane people instead of providing social services Correct. in Gotham City. But this time's underwater. Yeah. It's, it's that, but underwater. Gotham City sank. Sure. And a uh, nice Nemona there as well. Yeah. Um, cool real, real simple draw three cards, but three's more than one, so it's good. And we did get one of the big hits of the set. We got the very silly, very fun cartoon Clive. Special illustrator rare yes. is, I believe, the term for this, I which, you too. know, why not add a bunch of adjectives? Yes. Uh... But, all the team star bosses are there. There's, oh god, I'm, I don't know if I'm gonna remember their names. There's that's Penny. Sylveon. There's Penny. Uh, there's Aerie. Oh, that's what you meant. There's Giacomo. Oh. Guacamo. Giacomo. But yeah, it's, close. It's Giacomo, not Guacamo. Well, I guess I don't know that. Okay. Could be Guacamo. G -I. Gu Guacamo is how you pronounce the name. A G I. Yeah. A? Really? Okay. Yeah. Guacamo. We'll go with that. A I, 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 I know I know you, I know you, humans with that name. Okay. And they pronounce it Guacamo. Okay, I'll take that. That or they're that. messing with me for years. Uh, I do not remember the other two Team Star boss names off the top of my head. Uh, so blast me in the comments for that. But you have Clive, 
uh, aka Director Clavel, uh, hiding behind the tree there with a couple Applin in the tree. Uh, one of the chase cards of the set, um, not super competitively viable, um, but a very fun card nonetheless. Hey, if it you looks so cool. want to open maybe this Clive, maybe the Charizard, maybe the Gardevoir, uh, just let us know in the comments what your favorite card we pulled was, and uh, yeah. you could win a sealed ETB of Paldean Fates. But we got a very pretty, you know, again, we opened two ETBs, so it's about half of a booster box, so not quite as many hits as normal to show yeah. off. But honestly, just in two ETBs, pretty happy with all this. Uh, Joe, ETB what was... also comes with this nice little uh, yes. booklet that includes the full set visual does. spoiler. It does, so it's hard to be find. Like, yeah, you can be like, hey, here's all the cards that I hoped I opened. Yep. And you can uh, check mark them off as you as yep. you go to collect all of them. Yep. Joe, what was your favorite card we opened? Um, it's probably the baby shiny doduo. The dude, the doduo. Duo. That's yeah. fair. Yeah, green green bird. It looks really really nice. It's very vibrant. It is. Like probably like my third or fourth favorite thing is actually the the burn poison counters just because they're <laughs> foil. Like I was like, oh, they're foil, and they've got a non foil side if you want to be you know humdrum and boring about your day. Incredible. I think the palafin's my favorite. Yeah. I like the, the... I'm a sucker for the illustration I like all our cards. Yeah, they, they do a very good job of making the cards look really nice. They do. Even when they aren't that powerful. Yeah, but, no. Yeah. 100%. So uh, that's pretty much going to do it for this opening. Uh, we have a lot of fun stuff coming up, so please stay tuned. And I, I hope, uh, you know, like I said, we gave the details of how to win a couple minutes ago. So yeah. um, just do that. And we will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.